I've been working spontaneously for, for quite a long time, probably about 10 years, um, working from life. I, just, I love working from life. I think it's... I do do things occasionally that aren't from life, um, and then there's nothing wrong with using... or sort of making things up or using photographs. There's no problem. I've got no problem with that, but I always find the best things I ever did, as my dad always said, is the sketchbook. Because if he... If he he said that was my best work was in the sketchbook, and I agreed actually. And then that's when I started doing working from life because all the sketchbook work was from life. But then obviously the sculpture is a different thing. That's more ideas really that I develop. So it's another way of thinking. Uh, so it might be it might be an animal that I'm interested in, and or the relationship between a, an animal and a human being then I might sort of research that and I may not do that from life. That would be doing lots of drawings from uh, the internet or something of, uh, of an elephant or something or a, uh, an elephant being washed or something. That, that was an idea I had that I haven't really done yet. Um, yeah, so there's two different ways of doing it, Dif a different pro uh, approaches. So having the sculpture and the, and, uh, and the mono printing has been quite similar. Um, and they sit well together usually, and then the drawings are very separate to that because that's purely spontaneous. I've started getting into collage, really, experimenting with collage, just trying to shake things up a bit. Otherwise, you just keep repeating. The same thing. It needs to be. There needs to be a challenge to to do something that I don't really know what I'm doing. I still don't feel like I know what I'm really doing with collage, but I need that. Need to be in that place. I think to to, to sort of go forwards. <laughs> I think overall, the overall idea though is to try and capture movement really. With all in all said, you know, with all said and told, really, it's just capturing a snapshot of something, um, and in trying to do it in different way. I try not to have too many sort of preconceptions of what I'm going to do. Otherwise, you'll get disappointed, or you that you haven't come back with what you hoped you'd come back with. Uh, so it's good to just I just go with a lot of paper and a lot with a lot of materials for all possible scenarios, and then if it's maybe starting trying a bit of collage. Trying. I mean, I didn't have any paints today, but I'd often have a, some inks or some paints and, and do that. It's something I worry worry about on conscious office. I don't think that a lot of my work looks as if it's by the same person. You know, I, I think uh, that that worries me a bit. Or, but then people tell me that it does look like it's that I've done it all. But I don't know. There's some. I admire artists that you go to a gallery and all the works is pretty much the same, and it's got this what they call the cohesive thing. But yeah, that's just the way I am, I suppose. Just yeah, yeah.